more interesting news today. The dirty old bills of. Let's see what we can get to do with Life with Bilsif's YouTube channel. What's up, Bone Deadlies? Did I miss a song? How you doing today? Welcome to Life with Bilsif. Well, they're closed early. Spring right there. Big lockdown again coming up on the 26th, I guess, for the old uh, Southwest Ontario, too. Looks like they're shutting us down again. Captain, why wouldn't they? Oh, well, hey, you gotta be safe. You gotta be safe, you do. So I don't know if I'm gonna be off work or semi-retired or retired again temporarily. I don't know. We're gonna have to wait and see. Who knows? It's getting decked right over. It'd be good for the old Bakarooski though. But it was off. Maybe the back wouldn't feel so damn sore. Let's give her a rest job. So anyways, we're gonna have to see what happens when it happens. Let me know on your neck of the woods what's really going on with you guys. Because I wanna know. Friggin' right I do. I always wanna know. Love you guys, man. It's Christmas time almost here too. Hopefully everybody's ready for Christmas. Are you ready for Christmas? Guess what? Wasn't gonna put up the Christmas tree this year, but the daughter talked me into it last night, so the Christmas tree is up. Friggin' right it's up. And she's happy about that too. What are you doing, bud? Hi, douchebag. But, on a different note, I'm trying this uh, GoPro Hero 9, and I've got the iOS at 3200 instead of 1600 to see it's pretty dark in here right now. It might not look like it on the camera, but it's pretty dark in here. And I've got the other camera, which is a Hero 8 outside with wind reduction on, driving at 80 kilometers to 100 kilometers an hour. So we'll see how that sounds. How you doing, Mr. Brown? Hey, said. You see how that is? That's UPS if anybody's wondering, eh? My normal UPS driver from work. Good shit, yard. Pretty right yard. We're driving with normal settings, high iOS settings, and this and that and the other freaking thing. Captain. And we got a string here again, like I said, to hold the bracket in case it lets go. So we don't lose the old can of Ruski. Oh, Frank, almost forgot. Check it out. What's really going on? Now you got my first sweater in. Who does this? It's pretty good, it is. I didn't get my mug or my stickers. So I sent an email out for that too. And we'll see what happens there. If you buy my merch, it's all right. But it's not 100%, just saying. But it supports me and I appreciate it. But I like it. What's really going on? Frank, right. At least there's one good thing about it. They sent it DHL, DLJ, DL, DHL, something like that. That yellow, the yellow van guys there. They didn't send a FedEx, thank God, because they didn't stab me at the border. Got Mama's present in too today. Hopefully you can still see me. Like I said, it's darker than Gex in here. I'm starting to worry. Well, I can still see myself in the screen on the camera. So hopefully we're all good there. This thing better not freaking cock me over. I'll be pissed. Still waiting for the intake for the LS, just so everybody knows. What else am I still waiting for? Still waiting for more money, which we all are. And actually, if we go into lockdown again, that might uh, put a damper in some parts for the old engine build, the old LS swap. But you're going to have to freaking kick back on that a little bit if we go into lockdown and I get sent home again. It is what it is, it is. But on a good note, I updated my two cameras, so now I got better cameras. So I don't have to worry about batteries going dead so damn fast. So like I said on the last video, if anybody's looking for a GoPro Hero 4 just to beat on. It works good, they work good. Batteries just don't last very long, like 20 minutes, something like that. These ones last about two hours. Depends on what you're recording at, I guess. So if you wanna buy batteries for a GoPro Hero 4, hit me up and I'll send you one for, well, I shouldn't really say I got five of them. I got probably three that are all right to sell. The rest are kind of cocked over. They still work. They're just decker. One's missing the whole front piece, but it still works. So I really got three, 30 bucks a piece. I got three of them, Cap. Sounds like 40 bucks. Leave a comment down below or PM me on the old Facebook crack there. Face crackage. Jamie, you need one for when you go jump in that friggin' Subaru. Hit me up, 30 bucks, Jim. She'll be mint. You plug her in a cigarette layer and she'll record all damn day, Jim. Or you just buy new batteries for it. Here you go, either way. But I was done. I do enough recording for you guys that I need to invest sometimes in some decent cameras so you don't get cocked over. My Panasonic's a real decent camera, but it's too big. Legit too big to carry around with me every day. You put it on the dash of the truck, it looks like I'm friggin', it's, it's too big. Do you understand what I'm saying now? I'm pretty sure I made it clear that it's too damn big and the GoPros are perfect for what I do. Unless I'm at the racetrack, then I want my uh, Panasonic. Or if I need zoom, 
I take the Panasonic. But a lot of times I just take the drone now and then take it and it does all the zoom that I need. <laughs> Get as close as I want with that thing. Leave your comments down below and let me know what kind of camera you're using. If you're a vlogger and you're watching this video, let me know your gear. I know a lot of guys carry their Canon cameras and Nikons and whatever else on the big freaking Toldy stick, but I just don't. I tried a can. I had a Canon T3i or something like that, Canon T3i, and I just hated that freaking camera for vlogging because it would not autofocus worth a shit, and it would stop recording after so many minutes. It drive me crazy. I'd rather carry a nice little small GoPro and Bob's your freaking uncle. Well, we're gonna go home. I got a few videos ahead of this one. But I'm going to take a couple days off during Christmas, so I'll let you know in that video to come which days I'm taking off. Because it won't be on this video. Yeah, I don't need to let you know yet, so hang tight for that. Here comes a Dodge. Come again? Nice bright lights. What do you think? How are you looking up there, Mr. GoPro Hero 8? You still recording? Freaking right you are. And it's waterproof, too. Same with the 9. The 9's waterproof, too. So now I don't have to worry about these cases that muffle all the sounds if it's raining out. I need to just throw them on there. Oh, the freaking uncle. Yeah. Anyways, I'm almost home here and I rambled on for a good freaking 15 minutes for you. So I should have at least a freaking five or six minute freaking movie for you. Okay? I'm going to go home, relax the back because it's sore. It feels like somebody kicked me right in the nut. In the ball sack. I think it's a sciatic nerve acting up. That's what I think it's. Boss man at work mentioned sciatic nerve. Now that he said that, I'm pretty sure that's probably what's acting up. It's a sciatic nerve. So we'll get that thing straightened out sooner or later. Probably more later than sooner. But it is what it is. I just got to milk it until it gets better. Get some help at work when I'm doing the big jobs and just get through her, Captain. Love you all. Hopefully everybody's having a good day and a safe day. Everybody's keeping healthy. So I love you guys and I want you all to be happy and healthy and enjoy your lives. Until next time, don't do anything I wouldn't do. And you know what to do for now.